Greetings, royal family. I am doing behind the scenes with verbal shot this for my new and upcoming photo shoot. So hang out with me while I get ready. Um, I am going to be doing my hair in this first segment. It's going to have a little time lapse. I'm going to add some curls and volume to my hair. So watch it. Check it out. Watch with me. So old and I'm so unique. What's gonna happen when I plateau at my peak? Could use nothing but straight heat, number one for weeks. So if you up next, take your seat, cause y'all wet. Try to catch a wave, but nigga, we off that. If it go over your head, you call it a bar cap. They call me the professor, cause I said it all facts and all caps. In case you wanna know where the boss at, I'm the legend, I can show you what it is on the map. Show you how we live in the trap, through hell and back. And even if you ain't built like that, when it's kill or be kill, you adapt. Let your little homie gang bang. Ain't nothing wrong with a little bit of cane slain. I mean, we doing what we need to do to maintain. Besides, white man get paid off of everything. Like, I see a little blood on a diamond range. You telling me that Jesus changed it to change the thing? I can stand on this stage and spin my pain. And my shit won't bang unless a white man pay. But then again, what do I know? I'm just an eight town nigga with a nice flow. My blueprint based off survival. I bust shots and duck off from 5 0. And paint pictures just like Picasso. Hold on, wait. A little well got me feeling myself. I told the team back, back. I don't need your help. I stood there. Look him dead in his eyes. That little standard you say. I don't want to be Again. The way that I've been working, this is beyond the win. I need a girl so bad that she beyond the 10. And the water stay wet like Rihanna and them. Be honest, then, cause that line shit is beyond the sin. Real shit is all that we understand, cause I'm beyond the man. Bring the show to you, we on the man. Point them out, and we on the man. Y'all ain't ready for me. Family. So I'm taking it down to get ready for my shoot. I already beat that face. So. Here we go. So I already have put some um, on my scalp already, some Miracle Grow, and now I am gonna uh, put some oil in it, kind of shake the curls loose. I don't want to really run my hands through it because it's gonna pull the curls out. I do want to like wrap them and shake them out. You want to kind of help twi untwist it, but you don't want to shake the curls out of your hair when you're doing this. Kind of want to, you know, help unravel it and separate it. But not pull that. That it's making sense to you about what I'm trying to do. See, this side compared to the unraveled side. Boom, 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 boom. And not really beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna finish up for y'all. I will say in review, the style came out great. It did add a lot of bow, uh, body curls to my hair. If you want it to be more like refined curls, you need to make sure that when you do the bantu knots portion of it and you're wrapping it around that you get every hair. Because if you don't get every hair, you're gonna have looser curls like I do I'm just gonna put a little um coconut oil on it because I did put hairspray on it to kind of harden it a little bit more make sure that the curls stay for the entire photo shoot and you see I'm like scrunching it all together instead of elongating the curls because I do want to to stay and you also see why I did my edges in the beginning because now it's a really refined gorgeous look <laughs> 